for a safer pick like Corky, and indeed, that is locked in for Join B. That's much better. It gives you a lot of uh, wave clear mid lane if that ever does happen. Cassidy just gives way too much. Uh, Corky can also just rotate. And Shinny makes sure that Fire Lolly is aware of this fact, but they're still looking for this gank. Void. Spikes land, the flash comes out, but has got the Shen on top of them as well. Connects the taunt onto Loken. Ooh. He's not getting out of this one. Fire Lolly picks up first blood. Mouse is getting chased down by his army of minions. He will stay alive. the bottom lane? Rather than going straight towards and getting through those wards. Here we go. Hackers use. He'll arrive right in front of Mako, but a good reaction with the Shen may even result in Doinbee's death. He'll jump away, but that's the flash and the taunt. Securing the kill over there onto Doinby for the second kill over to EDG. Finally, he's not even needed. To the enemy team, and now that just gives them more pressure on the map. But we've seen time and time again. Oh, oh flash! Staring contest. Mako, he lost that one as Shinny jumps after him, hits him with the Koreans for after an easy kill in mid lane. And that's what I was gonna say. We've seen time <laughs> and time again that uh, the LPL team snake. I mean, they lost that mid lane tower super early, so he's not able to free himself. He's just saying, you know what? I have teleport. I can be there, but his pressure and presence is necessary. Oh, well, Cloud gets caught out because Fire Lolly and Zed are over the wall. That happened in a flash. And after that, maybe now they can just go for this top lane tower. Carby finds Scout, but he lands a W preemptively, <laughs> so uh, it'll just be this little kitten following him down. It's a hard oh, life to be a LeBlanc. Be though, but he's got the Mimic on the distortion. Oh! He's got a flash after him as well. Chains lands, but his last auto attack. Joy B with the kill and the one-on-one. -on -one. That was so needed. That was so necessary. EDG have to get out of there. Another engage happening in the top lane. Carby's here for moral support as Shinny just dives in, instantly dies. The flash taunt does not land onto Loken. Meanwhile, Carby is just not taking damage, but he doesn't have the Here's damage he is in the back lines right now. He is jumping onto Zed, but he needs Doimi oh. to arrive, who has come into this fight. Zed needs to get out, cut the vision. Fire Lolly jumps in, jumps onto Loken, gets the oh. one for one trade. Fire Lolly goes down, and Loken followed after as well. Doimi launching himself onto Mouse, and these rockets shut spell the end of this Shen. Oh, one more! Oh. The big one lands, chases them out. That's a five for two! And Doimi is suddenly massive. Fantastic. Teleport, though. Here comes Scout. He's gonna come in. He is the hero of the need, but instantly jumps away with distortion. He needs to pull some hero oh, no. play up, but Shin is here as well. Maybe he can burst. They have to come into the so one. The cloud's gonna go down. Baron assists on that one, but he jumps in and instantly locked up by Kabe. And this Baron will go over to QG. And ultimately, the damage has been done. A huge swing of power back for QG. We talk about this joking about the cloud dragon. The next time that it would rotate up. No, I think it comes down to the philosophy of the LPL teams, but hold on, all eyes should be on Kabe. Uh, an engage has to happen, and Kabe is on the front lines. He's locked up with those ethereal chains, goes down into the Guardian Angel. See ya, mate. And he will oh. eventually go down. Yeah, he's taunted up, he's dead to right. EDG pick up that kill, and they do stop the assault from QG for now. But that mid lane tower, they jump onto this Baron. And Fire Lolly may have to stick around and just come in with a miracle steal. Oh, no. Scout comes over the wall. Instant Nether Grass comes down oh. on top of him. But the assassination comes down. He got the one way trip, but it worked out for him. The one for two. The two for two. Kabe is following after Mako and Death. They take a lot of damage from those rockets. And Doinby, the one man army, is getting chased down by Mouse. But he jumps away. Instant Flash to keep him out of the fight. But this is still a two versus two. The tanks just can't die. But Mouse is a beast. He's following after to Doinby. And Kabe kites back to try and stop him. Knock up comes up. Free admission to the bounty castle right there, and there's nothing that Mouse can do. The rest of the team went down, and QG is just a matter of time before they get the ace. But Wait. so close, Doinby is playing this fight out still. Well, Mouse, oh what is he my. doing? He's going in onto Doinby. Another knockup. Two tanks were able to keep him alive by the sliver of his health right there. Mouse. Yeah, they know it's going to be a long kill right here because there's two tanks wailing <laughs> yeah, on the Shen, but Doinby evacuated. Kill Mouse is unkillable. What, He's gonna kill what even is happening? He may, yeah, you, he might just get the kill. And Kami just has to back away. He's not got the damage. Mouse, is, the team's actually just gonna Baron. start the Baron. This is taking 45 minutes again. Loken has two defensive items. That Caitlyn will not shred it. Look Shin. at this Baron. It's so low. Shinny comes oh. over the wall, but it's secured by Fire Lolly turning up. And out of play was base of Mouse in the top lane, dragging all of the attention from QG. How are they? Corky out from Kabe. He's gonna start off this fight. EDG instantly turn on towards it, but Kabe, he's very tanky, or maybe I've spoke too soon because he's getting completely shredded by EDG. He goes down into his Guardian Angel. Mouse follows after oh, no. onto Cloud, but he doesn't land his E, which means he'll also fall into his Guardian Angel, and the tank line will come back up once more. QG have the superior position oh. as Fire Lolly gets caught off to the side. Mouse jumps after as well. Kabe goes down. Join B following after. Will this be another Join B highlight oh. reel? Let's say no to that Loken. because Scout comes in. Loken comes off to the side and that will be the end of that transgression. A one for two. Ace in the hole comes across onto Zed. There's a teleport. Uh -oh. Here comes the cavalry. 
Coming in once more, and it's Scout with his full rotation available to him over the wall. Where can Loken go? Chases him down, walks him to his death. Another two kills over to EDG, and Shinji, regardless of what he does here, he's getting shredded down, but this objective will go over to EDG. They are committing a lot of resources to him, though, but he will eventually fall. Scout with a hero play. And they have so... They don't have Shinji, but they have the ability to go towards that Baron. And instead, they are committing to the Baron right now. QG will not reach them. Oh, oh my god, they got it for free. Very quickly. Yeah, they got it for free, but at the same time, QG, Last hope for QG. They have to try and take this one down, get the combat advantage. Mouse is getting blocked out by this line of traps right now, completely zoned away by Lolly over the wall. He, he does not get the steal. Now the combat advantage is over to QG, and Broken Kami safe. is still alive. Cloud getting chased down by Zed, off to the side, no one has died just yet, but Cloud's low, he has to retreat, Kami, he's got nowhere to go, and no Guardian Angel to save him, oh. that's a one for one trade, and Scout goes down into the Guardian Angel, but it's reset time for Fire Lolly, and QG evaporate under the assault of EDG, and now we have five for one, and the game. Zed, you man, he was gonna believe his team can save him from the wrath of Fire Lolly and Scout. This game is over. EDG, they go onto the Nexus Towers. 47 minutes on the clock. 19 kills to 13. It was a bloodbath in the end, but EDG, they take round one against QG. The Clutch Kings, EDG, proving that they're still a contender for the top title here despite falling and losing their streak to Newbie. Specifically, shoutouts to Zet there. You cover that nameplate, he looked like death.